with him? Yeah, it was really good. Uh, I think I got I got a block, I got a layup, a couple of rebounds. So, so it wasn't it wasn't the typical uh, big performance stat wise for me, but it was definitely good just to have him here. Uh, going into some early foul trouble, which is the worst thing to have on senior night. But uh, you can't be too upset when, when you be a really good team and you do play pretty well. Friend said he normally doesn't start the seniors. What was that moment like when he told you you were going to start? He said the first thing you did was you went over and gave Adam a hug. Yeah, because um, I think over the years people have always had this back and forth thing about me and Woody, like who should start, who should, who should come off the bench. But um, I think early on I was very, I was very um, adamant on starting. I feel like because when you come here as a young kid, you just want to have all the limelight and glory, but you have to humble yourself and understand that it's a team sport. Um, and this last year, Coach McCaffrey just told me that if I if I come off the bench, uh, just play as hard as you can. You're still going to play. So I think a lot of situations, I'm, I'm still I'm still in late game. I'm still getting around 20 minutes a game, so I can't really complain. Uh, so you just have to humble yourself. And I think I've been a very good six man for this team this year. And um, just a hug with Woody was just basically I don't know if he told Coach or if Coach asked him, but he could have um, complained because he's been been a star since he's been here. So but that was just a, a quick hug to say thanks. Um, I can take over it for one game and get back to normal. Is that an example of why this team's successful? The chemistry you guys have, with yeah. each other. Um, I think everyone just just understands their role. Um, I feel as though I could have, I could have complained the whole year saying I wanted, I wanted to start, I wanted to um, play a bigger role offensively. Uh, Josh could have done the same thing after playing pre pretty well. Sap could have complained after he's, he came out of the starting lineup. So I'm just understanding what the team needs and just sacrificing for the team really. What was it like at the end, you know, when you came out and everybody was cheering and the, everybody was standing up for you guys? Yeah, um, it was it was big time. Um, like I, like I said earlier, um, I didn't want to show too much emotion. I just tried to be professional for the couple hours in the game, and then I saw Whitey crying. I kind of that kind of got me going. So he told me he wouldn't cry. So I think he owes. I don't know where he is, but I think he owes me some some money because we had a few bets going about who would cry. So. I think I'm gonna eat well tonight. <laughs> money, so. Yeah, um, it was just very emotional. Uh, surprisingly, I didn't look over when my family was sitting or anything like that. So I think I did a pretty good job. No tears actually ran down. It was just more like just sitting in my eyes. So that was pretty good.